from the Bob Mills Weather Center, meteorologist Aaron Reeves. You know, I like my 60s and 70s with sunshine, but when it's February, I'll take that anyway. I can get it, quite frankly. And we start we started with that yesterday, 69. We're going to see two or three more days kind of in similar territory, so get out and enjoy it. Unfortunately, we're going to see a lot of clouds filtering through during that time as well. Overall, though, the month has kind of been up and down. We've seen almost equivalent below normal days to above normal days. Here's some of those clouds I mentioned, mainly in the mid and high levels that's streaming from the southwestern United States and the Pacific Ocean. Coming across, we also have a boundary stalled across the area. That's why we have 50s to the north, and we're already in the mid-70s to the south. Uh, so it's pretty interesting. We should all be at least into the upper 60s to low 70s by the time we get to later on this afternoon. To the north, not terribly cold by Bismarck standards. Minneapolis 28. A lot of 60s here in the south central and southeastern United States. So we're all uh, enjoying that. That That is uh, for sure, especially with today being a day a lot of people are off work. So I'm sure the golf courses and the parks are pretty packed at those, uh, those that are that are out or probably out there. A lot of uh, colors that we don't like to see up to our north, those are gonna stay there. Those are all our winter weather uh, advisories and warnings and all that nonsense. Not much going on here, but we are watching this L out there off the Baja. That's eventually gonna come our way, but you can see all of this moisture streaming in from the uh, southwest, and then there's that spin. That'll be moving in here as we head towards midweek. It's taking its time, but it's gonna get here eventually. Here's future view as we head throughout the day and into tonight. We'll see those temperatures tomorrow morning that'll be starting off once again, not terribly cold, 30s and 40s for most of us. Going into the afternoon hours tomorrow, we'll see once again kind of filtered sunshine at times with clouds passing through. Uh, those temperatures tomorrow will top out into the low 70s, maybe some mid 70s down to the south. And then as we take a look at what else is going on tomorrow, it is it is Mardi Gras, so the weather's good for that. If there are any festivities going on you're going to, that's good. Wednesday, 70s, a gusty southwest wind. Notice off to the east, there's rain. That'll be passing through much of the area during the morning and early afternoon afternoon hours and then that'll scoot on out of here and we'll see a pretty good but breezy afternoon. As far as severe weather, there could be one or two marginally severe storms. Better chance of that would be a far southeast Oklahoma, but beneficial rains uh, for a lot of people, but we need them further west and that doesn't look to be the case this go around. 50 for Thursday, so we'll be much cooler on Thursday, but we're going to have that weird gradient of much cooler to the north and still not too terribly bad to the south. Then Friday, a bit more in the way of cloud cover as rain chances reappear. We'll be in the 40s. Uh, so a couple of cooler days and then once again the rain chances the, the rain totals uh, the eastern third of the state where we have the least worst drought conditions is going to be the better recipients of this but a shed west where the drought worsens tough luck there uh, so it's not going to be ideal to get them that relief that they need 59 not much in the way of wind we're pretty calm in that category there's those cooler days that are on the way as we move forward also we're talking about those rain chances that will be off and on especially as we head to the weekend with a couple of passing systems here's a look at your extended forecast 70s through wednesday we will definitely enjoy that some places will get hung up in the 60s but all in all Still a lot better than where we could be, right? Rain likely, a few embedded thunderstorms Wednesday morning. That gets out of here cooler for Thursday and Friday, and then warmer, but still kind of on the unsettled side of things with off and on uh, precip chances as we head towards next weekend and early into the following week. But all in all, no crazy temperatures, so we'll take that uh, as we move forward, at least for now. Now back to you. I'm liking the 70s. Thank you, Aaron.